It's Massimo from Onikanabo. Today I'll be covering the function editor. So let's launch Kira. As you can see here, I'm starting from a blank profile and I'll be just using the K key as context sensitive shortcut. So let's create a function. Right click, create. Once you want to create a function, uh, you will have five different templates proposed. So the first one is 3D Studio Max Classic. It is not context sensitive, it is just pressure sensitive. So it is press once, set something, shift press, set something, control press, set something. And every time you press a modifier key, so shift, control, alt, it will be changing the shortcut. So here with this uh, template function, this function template, you will have eight possibilities. Let's go back, delete, and create another one. The multipress one is not a context sensitive neither, but here you will have more possibilities because it will be pressure sensitive, amount of pressure sensitive. So if you press once the key, it will do something. If you press twice the key, it will do something else. Three times, it will be something else and so on. Same thing for the shift press. Once, two, three, four. So let's make an example. I want to be in editable poly. I want all command and I'll be doing a cap. Copy, past. If I press two times, I want to collapse. And if I press three times, I want to extrude. Extrude settings. So save. And now let's go to the model. I'll be deleting the face, delete, border, and press once, it cap, as expected. So now I'm using the, the, the UI of 3D Studio Max because I started from a, a blank profile, so I can't use my own shortcut, but I'll be making a video uh, showing you that I can work without UI anymore. Thanks to Kira. So if I press twice now K, okay, it is supposed to collapse. Let's see what happened. One, two. It collapsed. No problem. Now let's cap this one. Go to face mode. And let's press three times. One, two, three. And it extrudes. No problem. So let's see now what can be done with the shift plus, plus press key. So let's call back Kira, show. As you can see here, I've set shift plus press once, it will connect. And if I hold shift and press twice the key, it will pain connect. So let's go. I'm in edge mode. If I press shift and hold shift and press K, it will connect. Okay, it worked. So Ctrl Z, undo. And now if I hold shift and press twice the K key, it will activate the pain connect here. As you can see, actually it is off, but it will be activated with if I press and hold the shift key and press twice the K key. And as you can see now it is activated. So I can I can paint connect. So now we do have more possibilities. It is four press multiplied by the different possibilities uh, thanks to the modifier keys. So multiplied by eight equal 32 hot key uh, on just 32 different tools 
on just one shortcut key. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. Bye.